Hey, Fairly Secret Music Group. Um, I want to show you some awesome box sets that I have. Uh, the first one, just a couple. Uh, the first one is Sly and the Family Stones uh, Higher. And this is a four disc box set. Uh, not really a box set per se, because uh, it comes in this 10 by 10 uh, packaging, and it is fantastic. It is, um, let me grab out the information for you. Uh, there's a book that slides in there, and this is what the book looks like. Uh, this is... 77 tracks with 17 previously unreleased songs, um, mono mixes, single mixes, live recordings, studio outtakes. It's pretty damn good. Um, this is a 10 inch by 10 inch book that's 104 pages, and this has a lot of pictures. Uh, liner notes. It has a little history of Sly and Sly and the Family Stone and then each song has liner notes written by uh, the members of the band and let me find uh, a lot of extra photos then there is a timeline that starts uh, when Sly was born on March 15th, 1943, and goes all the way through till, um, let me find out, 2013. Uh, Sly was 70 years old when this uh, box set came out. I know he, in the last five years, has won a lawsuit, I believe, and I think he won like $5 million in royalty or something like that. But this box set is a great place to kind of start if you are interested in Sly and the Family Stone. Uh, it roughly goes for around mm, 40 to $80 uh, $80 new, I believe. Uh, you can usually find them for about $40, $45 used. And I got this one for 25 bucks on eBay. I don't know why nobody else was getting it, but there was a buy it now, so I snatched it up. Um, another box set. Uh, this is of uh, 70s underground funk. Uh, it says 40 deep funk and rare groove classics, including tracks by The Honey Drippers, Sly Johnson, Harlem Underground, and Weldon Irvine. Some groups that I have never heard of before on here. Um, I guess it's a lot of really deep cuts, deep 70s funk. Um, this I got the same day I got the last thing I'm going to show you. Uh, I found out about this on accident. And this has... What did it say? Okay, so 40 tracks over... Um, I think it's three discs. No, it is four discs has a really weird way of opening. Uh, let me see. Ah. This is supposed to be smoother than this. I don't even know how to get those other discs out anymore. It's been a while since I, since I listened to this. But, comes this cool little box that was not the way I intended to show you this box set but we're gonna move on 
to what I think is the coolest funk box set out there. Uh, what it is, the funky soul and rare grooves. Uh, this is from 1967 to 1977. Uh, the packaging on this is fantastic. It looks like it was made in a craft class. Uh, this is really hard cardboard and uh, the let me show you the booklet. The booklet is about 80 pages with a lot of liner notes. Each band gets at least a paragraph, if not two. Uh, there's a lot of photos of the bands and the performers. Uh, it is fantastic. Uh, Claudia Lanier, if anybody has seen the movie um, 40 Feet from, Stardra, from Stardom, you'll know who that is. This is my favorite photo in the whole thing. Um, let me find it. This, this guy kind of looks like my nephew. And that outfit is fantastic my friend Mike needs that outfit so you get that and then housed in this this is where all the CDs are they're in these little slimline things normally I don't like that but I love this artwork a lot this whoops this last one doesn't like to come out And uh, let's see, where is it? The disc two, three, one, and four. So on this one, some of the uh, some of the artists you get bands like the Commodores and Cold Grits, uh, Soul Angels, Lou Johnson. Um, so some of the bands are people that you, the, the Barquets, uh, some of them are bands that you would recognize. Uh, this one has, uh, let's see, Wilson Pickett, Lulu, Shirley Scott, Johnny Harris, Brute Force. Clarence Wheeler and the Enforcers, Little Sister. Little Sister is, if you don't know, Little Sister is uh, Sly Stone's little sister who used to sing with uh, Sly and the Family Stone. She put out a few singles with on, on Sly's label. Uh, I think it was... Uh, stone oh gosh what was that called um, I don't know sorry sorry I can't remember but so that's disc two disc three with little Richard on the cover uh, this has little Richard Tammy Lynn Black Haze Express Wade Marcus, Baby Huey and the Babysitters, House Guests, Earth, Wind, and Fire, um, Rasputin Stash. If you don't know about Rasputin Stash, totally check out their first album. It is well worth the price of admission. It's so great. Uh, and then this... Uh, is disc four. It has um, like Herbie Mann, uh, Eddie Hazel, Phase O, Bobby Bird, uh, Clarence Reed, uh, Society's Bag, Black Heat, Claudia Lanier. Um, just a fantastic four disc set that I believe. I don't know. Sorry, I didn't mean to go into Christopher Walken there. 
Um, I believe this was put out by Rhino in 2006. I'm pretty sure it was 2006. Yes, from the vaults of Atlantic and Company Warner Brothers Records. Uh, again, well worth the money. I'm not sure how much these go on the used market. Yeah, this was 2006 by Rhino Records. I'm not sure how much they go on the used market. Uh, Discogs probably has one or two. Um, eBay. I found this at a local record store. I believe it was used for 20 bucks. I worked with a guy who had a single disc compilation from this box set, uh, like a highlights disc. And the same night I found out about this was the same night I found it used. And luckily somebody came in and uh, was looking for a comic that I owned personally and I sold it to him. So this was one of the things I bought. This and this, the payback. Two four disc funk sets. You cannot go wrong. All right. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.